everyone. I'm here to talk about the Design Center. The Design Center is a web-based app that lets you customize the data fields and templates used in your deployment. As users execute their projects in the desktop app, data from all projects is summarized and displayed in the dashboard. The dashboard can also summarize and filter data by key variables. For example, the number of projects at each location is summarized in this table. You can filter this report by project status and business unit. The data in dashboard reports and filters comes from individual projects. Project owners and team members enter data on the forms in their project files. Here in the project charter, you can see the business unit and location for this project. The fields that appear on forms are defined and managed by your organization in the web app, so you can customize data fields to meet the needs of your organization. And it's not just data fields that can be customized. Forms, tools, and project templates can be customized too. This is where the Design Center comes in. Only the people at your company who have been designated as data architects will see the Design tab and have access to the Design Center. Let's take a look. Before you can customize your deployments, data fields, forms, and templates, create a sandbox. The sandbox is a copy of your company's entire site. Here, you can make and test changes in an isolated environment. Once you're in the sandbox, you can easily see the customizations you can make. You can create new fields or edit existing ones by going to the Data Fields tab. On this page, you can see every data field definition available in your subscription. You can edit or create new fields to suit your needs. For example, you may want to change the values that are available in the Locations drop-down menu. The Sandbox is also where you design and edit templates for your organization. When you click the Templates tab, you can quickly see all the templates available to your users. These are the project templates. Project templates are what everyone must use to start their project. To modify any of the phases or tools in a project template, just open the template and make the changes. To start a new project template from scratch, click the New Project Template button. These are the management forms. Management forms are included in every project and project template in the system. You can see the management forms in the Project Manager when you have a project open in the desktop app. These forms are typically used to house the most important data fields that you want every user to fill out in their project, such as financial benefits and charter data. Let's say you want to modify the standard project charter. When you click the project charter, the Sandbox Template Editor opens so you can make the design changes. You can preview the change and save the template. All of the non-management form templates and tool templates are in the tool template area. You can edit any existing tool template by clicking on it, or you can create a new template by clicking the new link at the bottom of each tool type. Before publishing your changes to the live site, you can check them in the Sandbox dashboard. The new location already appears in the Sandbox dashboard reports. You can also open and check a few of the Sandbox projects that were copied from the live site. Let's open a Sandbox project and take a look at the Charter. The Charter has been updated in all Sandbox projects. Once you're happy with your changes, you can return to the Home tab and review the list of changes. From here, you can decide to publish the changes to the live site or simply discard them all. When you publish changes, all the changes you made and tested in the sandbox are pushed to the live site for all users to see. This is done with no downtime for your users. And if projects were checked out while changes were being published, the changes are automatically applied after the projects are checked back in. To summarize, the Design Center gives you the ability to customize and standardize your deployment, create the right data fields so your stakeholders see the right metrics in the dashboard, 
and create your own tools, forms, and project templates to give your users what they need to improve your company's products and processes. For more information and videos, go to www.minitab.com.